Hi, okay, so I'm about to, to do some comparison testing um, of INF and Beta Flight. So I'm going to use this very same quad um, for both the INF and the Beta Flight test. So at the moment I've got INF in it and I'm going to take it for a quick um, few uh, GPS rescues or return to home as they call it in INAV and then we'll compare to how it looks like when we do it with beta flight so let's do the INAV ones first and let me just adjust the camera so we can see the quad I presume we can so what I'll do is I'll just fly out there for a for a for a for a short distance and then Need to return to home. Okay, let me get it on. Hmm. Okay, so I'm um, ready to, to fly. I'm not going to fly far, I'm just going to fly maybe up to here and then rescue hit mode. rescue mode and it should be coming back so. okay. I was very close to where I, where I took off Let's and see it it's busy returning flying very gently Okay, so it's going to go and fly to right above the spot where it wants to land. Readjusting itself a little bit. Uh, coming in for the land. I'm, I'm surprised it again pointed that way. And so this time was a little bit further than before. It's interesting how it turns around and does it sinks. Okay, but it's that's very close. Rescue mode on descent. Okay, let's do one more. So this is still using INF. Very close. Okay, so let's show a bit of a of a of a hovering um, or GPS navigation hold, as they call it. So let me get it into into flight mode. I'll just fly out there a little bit first so that it gets some direction because I think it needs it needs to actually move a little bit to know which direction you're moving then I'll fly it back here this way and then I'll, I'll uh, break it when it gets close to me oops this is the wrong direction there I'm, I am Okay, so, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm not flying it at the moment, it's flying itself, this is uh, just navigation hold. I think I'm going to leave it like this for a while to see how long it will stay in place. I wonder if I can fly it a little bit lower, let's, let's try that. Oh, when I told it to go lower,
Okay. So it's in navigation hold now. I'm not flying it. Okay, there it's lowering itself a little bit. I'll just lift it up a little bit with the controller. Yeah, it's completely flying by itself. Okay, I've uh, loaded beta flight now on this little quad and um, I'm beta flight 4.5. I'm gonna take it for another flight and see what uh, GPS rescue does on this one. So it's basically with all the default settings. So uh, I haven't even tried it yet for the first time. So let's just see what it does. Activate this thing right. Let's see. Yeah, it's going the wrong direction. It's going the wrong direction. Let me try again. No, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> Is he chasing the drone? <laughs> Okay, I would say the beta flight um, GPS rescue also works okay. It's uh, it's landing every time, landing approximately here. That's where where uh, I launch from. So a little bit further than with uh, with uh, the, the INF, but 
um, I mean it's it's perfectly fine as far as I'm concerned. It, it la lands a lot harder, you know, with the INF it comes in really gently. For the small quad, I don't mind it landing hard, a little bit hard. Um, you know, the, the, the main thing is just that you get your quad back. Um, I would say I'm happy with a, with a beta flight return to home as well. Um, but I think I'm gonna stick with INAV on this little quad. Most of my other quads are on beta flight and I love beta flight. Um, but for this little quad it will be fun to play with all the navigation modes and everything that, that uh, INAV offers. So that's it. Uh, I'll conclude this video with that. Bye-bye.